Lonesome. <laughs> Lonesome and Madou Madoulo. So Manulo gonna be playing Cloud. We saw another Cloud earlier, but I still uh, feel like he has um, okay. the ability to like play in different styles. Uh, but we have so uh, Lonesome. Oh no, no he, okay, good. Yeah. <laughs> so Lonesome playing Link. Uh, he was in Link main back in Smash Four. Actually, super solid. I'm pretty sure he had some nice wins under his belt by the end of his career. And he's one of those guys that must be happy about what happened to his main. Link just feels so much more fluid and no tether grab means he uh, doesn't have to worry about opponent shielding so much. Right. In, in this game, shielding was toned down in general. And the fact that his new bomb, you can, it's so weird how they can play with it. It's almost like this level of like Pac-Man item play. Because they did C drop it and they could uh, hit the bomb with their whatever attacks they use, like tilts or an aerial. And the bomb just sent on the air, like it just flies somewhere off. And they will know where exactly that bomb is going to go. And they're going to activate it to slow, the, <laughs> to slow yeah, their opponents. Some, there's some amazing pressure uh, that Lincoln. Like, there was, I've seen videos wow. on Twitter of just the amount of oh, how much it hurts. That's I don't it? think he makes it back. Wow. Hey, did he snipe him? Did he get him? I, I couldn't hear the snipe, but yeah. Wow, that's crazy. Just when they're using the bomb. That's so crazy. The fact that bomb is going to do something like that, too. Oh, I've seen some cute things where, like, for instance, he'll drop the bomb, like, about maybe a quarter stage away from the opponent and snipe it with an arrow and it will knock into them. Oh, what? Yeah, because you can, from a long distance, like, throw oh, even boomerang into it. It's very, there's a lot of depth to it. Oh, B wow. out of down throw. Wow. Okay, that's something I've never seen before. <laughs> Definitely does a ton of damage. Feels like Medulla was just overwhelmed right now. Yeah, he's, he feels like he doesn't know what to do. <laughs> Ooh, oh, that, he almost got that man. He dies for it. <laughs> that boomerang came back too. <laughs> like he knew I was gonna use it right here. <laughs> and be like Snake, be like, damn. Oh, oh that he reset. Jab what? Yeah. Wow. That's interesting. Gets limit just in time, but another grab is gonna reset the situation. I'm just loving the way Main Wolf was playing, just showing the depth in terms of how. Oh, oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> Oh, okay, now, uh, Madoka's picking the bag, not really. <laughs> wow, that single hit back is just so good for starting combos. Did you, did you see that? <laughs> On the other hand, I feel like a lot of it is cute pressure, as in, the, a lot of the stuff that he's doing, although technical and flashing, only gets him a little bit of damage. Right, yeah. Especially against a character like Cloud, who, really, Majumu just hasn't had an opportunity to get in on him. Mm-hmm. Uh, the fact... I don't think, like, Mandula can even find, like, any way to get him back on the stage. Like, he, he, in, in neutral, he has no way of figuring out how to get into Lonesome because of the bomb pressure and the projectiles. He has no jump. Oh, wow. And another thing about it is because of the way that shield mechanics have changed in this game, projectile characters got a, just a general buff. Opponents can't just like power shield, power shield, they power can't. shield. No. They put them in the corner. They have to respect it. They have to. The timing is different. So especially if you're just not practiced with that timing, already you have to deal with so much more. Uh, and on top of that, just the extra speed. I really like the way Main Wolf was playing. I right. want to see. I want to see him do some more flash stuff. I want. I want to see more stuff that I didn't think was possible. I know Link can do a whole lot of flashy stuff now in this game. Like, I specifically the bomb, because they do, they could do so much with the bomb. Imagine like seeing like doing forward tilt, uh, bomb and using the forward tilt to send the bomb outwards, and then using that as an edge guard move to explode it. Oh, and so we saw that that Twitter combo, like how the link can like, uh, was it C drop, uh, first hit a back air, then C drop again with the bomb, and it continues, continues until it spikes at the end. It's like a, it's like an infinite. And we're off to battlefield uh, for this kind of pick. Um, hopefully, my duel should be using platforms to his advantage. Yeah, I can't believe Main Wolf isn't taking advantage of the beam from forward smash at zero percent. <laughs> really, that's that's the only problem I'm seeing with this gameplay right now. You should start off every match with that, because <laughs> getting hit by it just feels so bad. It does, actually. I agree. <laughs> Uh, does he have a jump? He doesn't end. Oh, oh. barely makes it back. Wow. I'm surprised he didn't try and Z drop it off the stage. 
Okay, yeah, I so. love that. It's Diddy Kong-esque. <laughs> oh, you know what? You're kind of right, actually. Because <laughs> I send it get up, and it's like, oh, yeah, you send it get up, I'm going to spawn my bomb right here. <laughs> and if Predictive. you jump, I can just read that and explode it preemptively. I don't believe it has a hitbox on the ground. Uh, the bomb? Not, not like a passive hitbox. Uh, no. Ooh. So it's not like he gets up or like he jumps into it and he would get No. I think when the... Oh, oh my goodness. He has to I... jump. Uh, one other thing is that uh, when the bomb, like, when you toss the bomb, it has a little bounce thing, right? You just saw. Mm -hmm. Uh, when it bounced, I think it still has a hitbox. So, uh, it still kind of has, like, the active frame. Sort of. But yeah. not really. This game started off really good mm -hmm. for Medulo, but the problem was he got put off stage, he got put on the ledge, and the way that Lonesome was taking advantage of it ever since then, okay, so that is not a true combo, no. or perhaps with DI he was just able to avoid it, but with the top platform he actually didn't get punished that hard. Mm -hmm. Ooh, if he had to that side B, uh, Lonesome was winning for that, and Porto is going to do it actually. And just to. Yeah, that's yeah. Okay. no jump too, so of course he wouldn't make it back. Alright, this could be my duel's last uh, uh, stock here. Whoa, that one in the back here, and then oh, an upbeat. I he's been doing that for a couple kills, but at this point, just putting Cloud off stage in that bad position, especially based on how much mileage Lonesome has gotten. Oh, okay. Nah, he's just like, I'm gonna bomb myself so that I can come back on stage. It's a mix up. It's a, he, he can't up air you. <laughs> he can't. Uh, I uh, don't think that'll kill. Nah. He definitely could have killed with a dash attack or something. Uh, yes, let me. He can make it back for free. Nice tag, but it doesn't no. matter. Oh, uh, did he disrespect him? Nah. It was a little bit of disrespect, bombing uh, himself into the blast zone. Oh, I didn't see that part. <laughs> he, <really laughs> he jumped off the... So he's dead, right? Uh, where is it? Yeah, he could have up BP and Watch this. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> uh, you're funny, Lonson. Uh... <laughs> That match is taking forever. Yeah, Lonesome is, there are a bunch of players who were 